six-cylinder engines are legitimately desirable in imports BMWs, Jaguars, Porsches yet in pony cars they've always been plagued by the Rodney Dangerfield syndrome. As the old rap goes, V8s are for those serious about performance. V6s are for secretarial pools and rental fleets while Dodge and Ford both offer V6s with 300 or more horsepower. The home of the Hemi and the house of EcoBoost don't have their hearts in those engines. This gives Chevy the opportunity to indulge in the joy of six with its freshly revitalized Camaro. We don't have secretaries anymore. And during you, we noticed that the 3.6-liter 335HP LGX V6 the Camaro shares with four Cadillacs is a palatable alternative to a honking V8. Times have indeed changed. The Camaro LT tested here rings in at $35. 150, uplifted from a base four-cylinder with a $1,495 V6. $895 dual-mode exhaust and a $1,950 RS package, 20-inch wheels and tires, high-tech lighting, and a few sporty trim pieces. That's the high end of affordability. But oh, what you get, it snarls unlike any American V6. And the 223-pound lighter nose relative to the V8 versions makes it a backroad Barishnikov. This V6's appetite for RPM shot us to 60 miles per hour in 5, 1 second and to 103 miles per hour in the quarter mile in 13, 7, quicker by 0, 4 second in both measures than the U equipped with an 8 speed automatic was a full second off the Camaro's pace. GM's 4 cam V6 plants its spunk by pulling smartly from 1,800 revolutions per minute and by tickling the sound meter with rich resonance at 5,000 revolutions per minute. At the 7,000 RPM redline, four tailpipes spout speed metal. The chassis is nicely balanced thanks to the engineer's weight saving and stiffness enhancing accomplishments. The V6 is tucked back as far as is practical. Quote. 